Does anyone remember me? Slim Body Challenge. First episode, oh, Tabata. Oh, Do you remember me? <laughs> oh, I see many reactions. Thank you. Now that I come here, I can see many people are slim. You must have been working out really hard during the COVID period. So I'm here again for rebalancing some healthy stretching exercise. I hope you are looking forward to this, right? I'm a fitness expert and I've been working as fitness expert for about 25 years. You know, the millionaires and new generation are very enthusiastic about their health. And recently, the study seller to rebalance your muscle. This is my recent book, and I'm going to talk about these things. So I'll start my lecture right now. I believe you won't feel the same way as you used to in the past. Even yesterday and today feels different. Why do you think so? In the first page, there was a phrase that goes, the fatigue you have for that day needs to be relieved in that day. Otherwise, you are going to have chronic fatigue. So this is not only about you. It's actually survey targeted for people in their 20s and 30s. We observed them, people in their 20s and 30s who are working every day. And we observed them for six months. And all these people were having stress and chronic fatigue so almost everyone in today's society they are suffering from chronic fatigue and the most important pain is back back ache and what about shoulder is there anyone who have pain on their shoulders and on the neck and everywhere yeah that's why i prepared this Next month, we are going to share some videos to take care of this pain. Thank you for the applause. And the chronic fatigue, this is not only from your work, but the why you feel different from before is because of aging. If you are living on the planet, we are influenced by gravity, and that's why we have this kind of curved spine. That's why the height is becoming shorter and shorter. And I also feel that as well. That's why stretching exercise is really important. And we are aware of the importance, but actually it's quite hard to, to do this in practice because when we are moving our body, we can have awareness of our body. But if you're just using your head, your brain to do your business, you're got to have imbalance between your body and mind and that leads to chronic fatigue. So there's one tip here. Sometimes you want to lose your weight and to do your business, you need to move your body. And movement is the key word, global key word. Nowadays, the life expectancy has been prolonged. People are living up to 100 years and 120 years. So you need to maintain health for your joints. These are joints in your body, ankle joint and knee joint. So many people have pain pain and the joint. So ankle is also joint, knee and hip joints and spine joint and we also have cervical spine joint. The muscle should be soaked in this joint part so that you don't feel fatigue. So stretching is how you can move this kind of joints freely and you need to do workout. So how we can do this? So we have an instructor here with me on the stage. She's working with me. She looks really young, right? She's good at yoga, pilates, and aroma. She's Paul Sunhee, fitness expert. 
She is an aroma therapist and also Pilates and yoga expert. She always used aroma in her classes. So I'm going to explain and she's going to show. So we are uh, seeing many aroma being used in yoga class and Pilates class. So we have oil here. So imagine that you have one. So when you wake up in the morning, Miss Ha is doing this. She drinks warm water, a glass of warm water, and on the table, she puts warm water and she puts peppermint oil, one or two drops of peppermint oil. And like you just heard from the curator, it has the effect of fragrance. So your living room or your room will be filled with the scent. So you get the energy in the morning. There's nothing special. You just drink water and you put oil and the space is full of peppermint scent and you get energized from the morning because in the morning you might be busy and you don't have time for stretching. And then this is what we prepare, jojoba oil and lemon oil blended. So after lunch, you need to start work again and you might feel tired and you might feel down. In those situations, on your desk, when you sit down on the chair, you can put few drops of oil on your palm and make some heat and inhale the scent, the lemon scent. And it will boost your vitamin in your body. It feels like vitamin is coming to your body. And inhale and exhale and it makes your eyes really clear. That's what many members say. And behind your ears or back up the neck and next to your temple, you you can put the oil, the lemon oil, all over the body. So your body is now covered with vitamins. And I believe all the people would know that stretching is really important. So when you both have aroma and stretching, there is synergistic effect. Do you want to try with me? And many people are doing Zoom meeting these days. So every time you do Zoom meeting, you can add this one. Let's see. Lemon oil and peppermint oil, you inhale the oil and now the space is full of fragrance and then, you know, you will feel fatigue the, here on the neck first. So your neck muscle will always suffer from the neck and grab the bones on your neck and you will feel that it's really tense. So those bones on the neck so when you click and when you touch the neck, it relieves the tension. So it's really good if you can do this every day. It can relieve your headache and tension. So try it with your right hand and left hand. And with right hand, you can touch the left side. And with your left hand, you can touch the right side. So both lines of your cervical spine will be relieved. And put your hands down. Now, we don't have much space, so I will tell you how you can do this more efficiently. It would be better if you can raise your arm, but if you have pain on your shoulder, Fold your arm and stretch towards <laughs> upwards. So everyone is raising their hands. So as if you are stretching your spine. Inhale and when you exhale, it's not your arm that's moving. So let's think of your spine moving, tilting to the side. If you raise your right hand, your right hip should be pushed towards the chair and your side will be stretched. 
And now you need to inhale aroma scent and expand your ribs. Muscle is like a rubber band. So until it gets so, you need to breathe and come back to the original posture. So it can make your shoulder pain if you do this too fast. So let's try with the opposite hand. So now inhale and exhale. So stretch towards sideways. And if you are raising left hand, you need to put your left hip on the ground and expand your ribs and stretch your body and come back to the original posture and raise the opposite arm and put together your hands. And I think you are familiar with this posture. Sometimes when people have pain on their shoulders, the neck is just protruding towards. So with this posture, you need to put up your chest. Do not bend your back. You need to move your chest upwards and go to the side way and point your finger to upwards. So now your muscle has gotten a little bit softer. This is really simple, but not many people are doing this. And to the opposite side, and show your palm to upwards. So many people who are feeling tired, their fingers are kind of curved, so you need to stretch your fingers as well. And one more time, stretching, inhale, and exhale inhale and to the original posture and when you put your arms down on your back what bone do you have you have this bone bones on your back so try to squeeze the bone on your back and you will feel like the bones on your back is being squeezed this is how you can stretch your back and we'll now try to walk on your hips it's like walking on your hips so one side of your hip goes up and down go up and down so naturally your spine moves together with the hip for stretching so I think this has made your back somewhat relieved. So you need to at least do this to relieve your chronic fatigue and relieve pain on your shoulders. So we have this kind of stretching exercises. All family members can do this and also when you are lying down and ankle stretch. When you are lying on the sofa, you can do some stretching exercises. And when you have pain on the shoulder and on the side, and when you have some pain with the muscle, what you can do to relieve the pain, you can use some tools to do that. So we have prepared videos for that. So rebalance is the key word in these times. So us fitness experts, when we are checking our customers' health, we are checking their flexibility, agility, their speed, their posture, endurance, and cardio pulmonary capacity. But what needs to come first before that is whether they have sub joints or not. And when you do stretching exercise together with aroma oil, it can boost the synergistic effect. So I hope you stay healthier, not only you, but all the other people around you. Thank you very much.